I live in a small town. I live in a small town in the uh, south. The south part of the United States, okay? And here's one of my little problems about the south. It's just very Christian-like. I mean, Christian-y. I know it ain't a real word, but that's how it is for me. When I was growing up, there was always the mentality that if you went to church, you were good people. You know, it was like, oh, you don't go to church? No. Sinner. Evil. Satanist. But if you went to church, you were supposedly good. That was growing up. Eventually, the Christianity had itself a little uh, black sheep that ended up really being a flock. And that was the uh, Bakers. You know, Tammy Faye and Jimmy Baker. You had evangelists who were stealing money. These were evangelists were the TV Christian yahoos who thought they. You know, thought their piss was the holy water, you know. And these were the people who thought they were the greatest creatures on the planet. The problem was... The problem was... They got in trouble. And other people started getting in trouble. And then priests were getting in trouble. And so at one point it went from... Oh, you go to church, he, oh, he, he's a good person, he goes to church. That's what everyone says. They still say it now. Oh, he's a good guy, he goes to church. But after the Baker, you know, TV evangelist problems and the priest problems, scandals problems, whatever it is, suddenly... Suddenly, people really just stopped saying that as much. You know, I would have people who used to say it all the time when they describe somebody. Oh, he's a good person. He goes to church. She's a good woman. She goes to my church. Now, suddenly, they were being quiet about it. Suddenly, it was, he's an okay fella. She's an okay fella, a lady. And it and they can't they had to sort of realize what I've always known for years. And that was just because you go to a church does not make you one hundred percent Christian. You know, I go to Publix every day. That doesn't mean that I live or work at Publix. That just means I go to Publix. And um uh, you know, the problem is, there are a lot of people, particularly in this town, there are a lot of people who go to church for all the wrong reasons. To them, church has become more like a Prada bag or a Gucci bag, like a designer accessory. Something you can parade around and go, Hi, I'm better than you, I go to this church. And, um, you know, it, it's disturbing, really. I remember going to church a few times when I was younger, and I, I just remember getting kind of sick off of seeing it. Because you would have these people going, you know, you would have these people going, you like my new dress? Yeah, this was $108. Isn't it great? I got $108 at JCPenney. This purse right here, this purse right here cost me 75 bucks. Oh yeah, and next week, we're going to get a manicure. That was literally what church was. You know, before the, before the, like, sermon started and all. People be kind of gathering around, waiting for the person under the cloth to come in, you know? And that's what I would hear. I would hear women, young women, old women, 
girls that were my age, they were going around, you know, doing that too. They were talking about how much their dresses cost, how much their, you know, purses cost, how much their clothes cost, you know, how much money they made. Sort of bragging about their money. And then they would turn around and, particularly teenage girls, but even grown women were doing this. They would be flirting in church. Now you know that's wrong. They'd be sitting in church going, Michael, bro, you push your high. They did that, you know. They would be sitting there singing the whole time, looking at each other going, Can I have your number? You don't do that. And these were the people that the others had thought were good people because, oh, they go to church. They put on their dresses and their suits and they go into church once a week for an hour. And that makes them better than anybody on the planet. And it was that sort of mentality that really made me not want to go to church. Because like, I don't want to go to church and have somebody... Sorry, I picked my nose in. I didn't want to go to church and have someone... You know, bragging about what they had. If I want to listen to catty people brag about what they have, I'll go to school. You know, public school, I can be picked on because I didn't, my parents didn't spend $150 on a pair of damn shoes. You know, 